All right, can you guys hear me? Am I pausing? Is it working? Are we good? No here, just see. Okay, great. It says I'm not muted. Oh boy. See yes, hear no. Not good. All right, well, we're gonna keep going until we get it right. Sound. I see ya. Hear nothing, frozen image. Yes, here now. This is frustrating. All right, we're gonna let it run for a little bit. All right, well, we'll see how this goes. <sighs> All right, well, we're going to get to work. Sound is working. It's working. can hear you loud and clear. I'm running with it. We'll see how well this goes. I can hear myself on the delay on my monitor back here, so I'm just going to I'm going to see how Ugh, it's always something with me, isn't it? Here we go. So, we left off last week. YouTube, and it froze up. God damn it. Well, it's just dandy. Well, we're going with it. It is what it is. If you give me one second, I can probably fix this here. Give me one second. We're back. We'll see how this goes. Give me a second. All right. Had to go turn off the Wi-Fi. We are back. We're going to do, do our best. Okay. So, we got all our walls painted, as I said. We got that done last week with my dad. I'm going to get that out of the area. You guys can see my ink block test as well. We're going to toss that to the side. And we're going to work on the windows tonight. Well, to start tonight. No, it wasn't the Disney Plus. I know exactly what was happening. I had a laptop upstairs running as well, uploading stuff. So I was hogging the internet tonight. It was me. I was the culprit. All right, actually, before I finish cutting that out, I'm gonna do one thing that I wanted to do. So we're gonna dry brush these windows. What's with the closed captioning? What's the closed captioning? I don't have any closed captioning on mine. Is there closed captioning? That's awesome. If there's closed captioning, maybe my dad just has special settings turned on because he's he's deaf. 
Yeah, I think it was I was because I was uploading stuff, so. I'm just gonna dry brush these windows. Let's see how that goes. Um, I'm dry brushing these windows. I think my dad showed that tip the other last week um, because it brings out a pretty cool highlighting effect. You still get the red coloring, but it allows me to, um, it allows the windows to like have a little bit of an accent on it. Just came from Human City. Human City. Huh. All right, we're just using some white, antique white to dry brush this like aged oxidation look on our windows. Hopefully you guys are having a good time doing this live build with us. I know my video quality is shoddy at best sometimes, but my dad's is much better. Hopefully mine's better now that we got everything. Dang, I didn't know we had closed captioning. That's, look at that. We're just moving up in the world. These are the masonry windows. Just gonna weather these real quick. I think, yeah, I think my dad showed you guys this part already. Uh, he painted his windows blue. Obviously, I did mine red. I didn't really do mine red. I did mine in a color called Black Cherry. All right. I got them all done. I'm going to go find my other brush real quick. That's not my brush. Hang on. We got a lot in store tonight. A lot of fun in store. So, the next step is to me moving all this crap around off camera. Okay. Scott Perry can't hear the closed captioning. Oh, well, sorry about that. So the next thing we're going to do is put our windows into our walls. Uh, there we go. We'll move these dormer pieces out of the way. Cut these windows out real fast. And like my dad said, we're going to build the walls out flat. The walls are going to be put together flat because it's easier. It's easier to put our weathering on. It's easier to put our signs on. Um, just everything when you're working with the walls flat, it's just so much better. I'm just making sure I clean up these little burrs on the edges of my wall, my windows. Uh, after we get these windows in tonight, we're going to be doing some uh, signage. We're going to do a little bit of weathering as well. But just light weathering. I'm not going to overweather this building. And I know I say that every time, and you guys make fun of me because I always end up weathering them hard.
you guys always get a good laugh out of it because I say, oh, I'm not going to weather this one very much. And then I end up doing it and uh, it looks like it just came out of a, a war zone. But I promise this one we're not going to do that that much this time. What I will do is show some like streaks around the window edges, kind of like, you know, where that, oh, I, you know, it's streaking grime comes out from the edges of windows the edges uh where features would be like um a lamp hanging off a wall you know you get a little bit of a runnage is that the official word runnage i've never used a spruce cutter scott yes lynn they know a little bit about walls too My dad says everything looks very clear tonight. So hopefully it looks better than it did the first night. Because live night number one with mine was a complete disaster. As far as video quality. I'm looking over at my monitor, which is on a delay. Which is hard to work with. And it looks pretty clear. It's a little blurry on my end, but... I weather lightly in the beginning William and then I uh, end up usually end up weathering pretty heavy but this is my favorite cutter right now the slice holds the number 11 blade I love it because sometimes I can just hold it like this sometimes I just put my finger through it's my favorite All right.